Good day, my little teacups. Would you like to join me on an adventure? I am your host, the Over Englishman, and welcome to Long Live the Queen. Another one of those visual novel games. Although this one has once upon a time been described as the Dark Souls of visual novels. Everything and its mother and its dog, its grandmother and its pet hamster and its pet hamster squeaky toy will try to kill you. You are Elodie, the little princess of the land, trying just desperately to survive until the bloody coronation. Now, I am aware that this title screen looks ungodly strange to some of you, but trust me, I think this game is going to be good. Now, also, if you happen to be able to see my mouse, apologies for the fact it is continuously going to be bouncing up and down, but that is because this game has a very strange adaptive frame rate that it only redraws frames uh, when it has to. So I'm having to use the mouse to make it redraw frames so it will actually record. Yes. <clears throat> Shall we? Let's go. Start game. We are almost home. Your room is just the way you left it. Oh, dot dot dot. I know it's hard to leave your school and all your friends, but I've arranged the best possible tutors for every subject. You'll have to work hard this year to prepare yourself for your 15th birthday, but I know you can do it. You'll learn quickly and you'll make a wonderful queen. It's what your mother would have wanted. This is not what my mother would have wanted. She wouldn't have won. Whoop, 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 whoops, sorry. <laughs> Broke the drama there. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> ah, there we go, I'm more comfortable in my chair. She wouldn't have wanted to die and leave me. No, she wouldn't. But sometimes bad things happen. We have to pick up and carry on. Really, Daddy? Really, Peter? Thank you, Dada. Thank you, Father. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yes, um, for the purposes of the playthrough, if we happen to encounter any female characters, I'm just going to give them stupidly manly voices. But, hey well, you love me all the same, don't you? All of Nova depends on us. On you. Ah, well, no pressure then, Dad. Thanks. Sigh. I will be here to guide you until your coronation, but the decisions you make are ultimately up to you. Up to me, are they? Well, it wouldn't be a visual novel if- Come. Mm. Your maids are waiting. Th thank you, Dad, for interrupting me. My point being, it wouldn't be a visual novel if the choices were just taken away from you, now would it? What kind of Sakura game do you think this is? Ah, here we go. Now, uh, I will uh, give you a little bit of a- a preview here, audience. I might have dipped into the game already, so I already knew the tutorial, and this is going to save about 500 hours of video time. Effectively, here we go. Elodie has a mood. This mood is affected by events and things that you do on the weekends. In the skills tree, as you can see, we have a fuck ton of stats. Now, what this equals is that we can take classes in these stats, and our current mood affects which stats we learn faster. Here we go. And each stat is broken down into three parts. So, Royal, royal Demeanor has Composure, Elegance, and Presence. You can only raise these to a certain point until the other ones are at a certain point as well, and then they can all go up at once. So, we can also, uh, though we have none to pick from, we can choose an outfit. And these outfits give you stat bonuses. Yes. The classes are what we do of a week. We choose what classes we wish. Now, hmm, trying to think what I actually want to do. Um, how, how are we feeling right now? We're depressed, which means we've got a bonus to expression and animal handling, but a penalty to royal demeanor. Yes, there will be checks against pretty much everything. I don't think falconing comes into pretty much anything, but that's, uh, we'll have to find out, won't we? Let's see... Um, let's learn weapons. And in weapons we're going to learn swords and pole arms. Yes. That's what we're going to spend our week doing. We'll take up a wooden sword and practice correct grips and stances. You learn a variety of long weapons. From the quarterstaff to the spear and the halberd to the glaive. 
What was all that noise outside? Who's here? Oh, it's my cousins. It's my aunt and uncle. Darling, we were so terribly sorry to hear about your mother, Fidelia. Thank you. You look well, niece. Hi, Lottie. Lottie, sorry. <laughs> Hi, Lottie. I haven't seen you in ages. Will you be staying long? Yep, Mummy said we'd be here all month. Maybe we'll have some time to talk later. Now here we choose what we do at the weekend, I suppose. Um, let's let's make ourselves a bit less depressed. You will attend services in the castle grove, letting the peace of the ritual calm your heart. What the hell happened to you? You were terrified. Oh, that's because I moved his afraid. Oh, fair enough. Uh, bonuses to agility and faith. Ooh. Well, I think whatever we're going to go into this time, agility, agility, reflexes, reflexes. Because if we've got shit to dodge, we want to be able to dodge it. Morning. Your teacher walks around you, prodding a finger at you slowly in order to train you in blocking those touches without triggering a fear or faster breathing. You practice solo tennis, hitting a ball against the wall repeatedly in order to train your hand and eye to react, also to look like you're in a prison movie. You may now play sports at the weekends. Ooh. Thank you. Lovely. What's that commotion outside? Father, what's going on? I've come to pay my respects in honor of your mother. You have no respect or honor. It's because of you and your powers that my wife is dead. She killed mummy, dearest? What? I... I am a woman, as was she. And like every woman, I am willing to give my life if necessary to protect our domain. Your line has been traitors for 200 years. I won't have you corrupting my daughter. No, I shall not be corrupted. That is for the Grand Princess to decide. Do you think this is Terraria? Oh dear, your mother trusted me. And I have much to teach you. Hmm, ah, uh, I don't know, we only just bloody met the woman. Dad says that she's responsible for mum dying. Uh, but apparently that's something to do with magic. I don't, I don't, uh, uh, let her stay for fuck's sake. I want to hear what she has to say. She stays! God, that face is terrifying, what the hell? As you wish. Thank you, Daddy. No! <laughs> um, let's see. Let's go, uh... Well, we don't want to make ourselves more depressed. Let's attend court, see what happens. Sitting in court sessions <coughs> is not fun at all, but it pleases your father and it may be important for your future. Oh, we're depressed again. Shit. No! Why? Uh, let, let's learn some composure this time. I think we've got high enough reflexes for pretty much anything right now. You are too depressed to focus properly on this subject right now. Bollocks! You practice deep breathing exercises, learning to find and maintain a sense of inner calm. He loves me! He loves me not! Lottie, do you have a boyfriend? Not really, I just like to play with the flowers. All of a sudden, the Duchess of Ursul rushes into the garden and points a sword at you. Who the fuck is the Duchess of Ursul? No, not at you, at your feet. Oh, it's her, it's her. Princess, don't move. Uh, look down. You look down where her sword is pointing. <laughs> There's a snake in the grass. And I open the save menu again, fuck. You can't help it. You squeak and jump back. The snake tenses and prepares to strike. No! Your cousin pushes you aside and the snake's fangs sink into her leg. Lottie! Too late. Juliana swings her sword and cuts off the snake's head. Bah, brutal much. What is going on out here? You're, you're not, I'm trying to remember these women's voices as I'm going along. Your daughter's been bitten by a milk viper. They are poisonous. Get an herbalist right away. Also, this music is going crazy right now. I will treat my daughter 
I certainly can't trust anyone here to keep her safe. I'm sorry. I don't feel good. We will be returning home to Martha immediately. You aren't as a point. Milk vipers are not native to this area. That snake should never have been here. Someone may have tried to kill you. Will Charlotte be okay? I don't know, but this music is really loud. Let's see, um... What, what is our mood? I don't even know. Okay, we can make her pressured. Pressured? We can make her angry. Jeez. Uh, God, t calm down, music. There we go. Oh, thank you. Thank you. The music's calm at last. What is it? Oh, for God's sake. I keep opening the save menu. <laughs> it's it's because it's bound to right click audience. Whenever I click the save menu, it goes yeah. What is it you wanted to teach me? First, I need to know if you have your mother's crystal. Crystal. Your source of power for any lumen is a particular magical crystal. Once you've bonded with it, it becomes part of you as long as you live. The royal crystal has been passed down from ruler to ruler for generations. It belongs to you. Now, except that the king may be keeping it from you. Do you have a crystal? Of course. She holds out her hands, light flickers above her bosom, and then, with a shower of sparkles, oh, sparkles, something takes shape. You reach out to touch it. It dissolves away into nothing, and instead you touch her bosom. This is very awkward. Oh! It belongs to me. No one can take it from me until I die. You need to find the crystal that belongs to you. I see. And we're afraid again. Lovely. Uh, let's let's go for agility this time. Dance. Let's learn to dance our problems away. Yes. Yes. You practice curtsying, standing, and walking across the floor in a graceful manner. You practice different part and dance positions, closely held, at a distance, and non-contact. The appropriate hand placement for each. The castle seems quieter with Charlotte and Emery and Zara and their parents gone. It's certainly not empty, though. It seems like we get more servants every day. I'm so worried about Charlotte, after that snake bit her, but her mother said she's okay, so I, I guess it turned out alright. I failed the that test for poison, oh dear. Maybe she has a guardian angel. Maybe she's just some kind of poison-eating monstrosity. Who knows? Uh, talk to Daddy. Dad, what happened to Mum's Lumen Crystal? It's in a safe place. Can I have it? No. But it's mine! Meddling with magic killed your mother. I don't want that to happen to you. Once you're crowned queen, I can't stop you from doing anything you want. For now, you're still a child. Oh, well, fine. Fuck you, Dad. Let's see, you tell me what to do. You think you can tell me what to do? I'm Princess Elodie, bitches! I got pig hair and eyebrows that exist outside of my hair. Hell yeah! You learn to relax and evaluate the tension in your body. Then and practice different types of moti motion. Whoops, not motivation. Uh, <laughs> Let's try that again. Then to practice the different types of motion available to each of your joints. Twisting, shifting, and the rotating. You practice bouncing motions with your arms and legs to increase the muscular effect. You've unlocked a new outfit. This is what I was talking about, audience. You specialize enough in one stat, and you get an outfit that boosts that stat. One of your maids approaches for your attention. My lady, couriers have arrived from the Duke of Sedna. We have a Duke of Sedna? No, my lady. The Duchy of Sedna in Talas. They've brought you a letter and a gift. Condolences to the death of, deeply, deeply regret, of the best wishes. Oh, what a beautiful necklace! Something sparkly will definitely make me feel better. It's all shiny! Yay! This will easily cure my depression. 
Uh, yielding, I suppose. Sitting in court sessions, da da And we're still fucking terrified. Let's check out this outfit. A tutu, the booster agility. Lovely. Well, I can't wait to see what happens when we turn up wearing this to court. Um, conversation? Maybe? Court manners and court manners. Let's learn that. What the hell? I don't even know what we need. You review the correct greetings for guests according to rank and when to extend your hand to another. All nobles expect their due honors. As the person of the highest rank within the domain, no one may sit at any formal event unless you give them permission, and no one must ever turn their back on you. If they do, you are intended to recognize the insult. Uh, so no one could just, like, go to the toilet or anything, I suppose, without... Wait, what? Do they, must they face me all the way out the door? As you are walking, you spot a familiar figure in the palace gardens. It's the Duchess of Ursula. Maybe I should go and say hello. Then you notice that seated beside her is a woman in robes of a priestess. They are very close together, their hands gently touching as they speak. Ooh, looks like she's busy. As you turn and walk in a different direction, so as not to disturb them, at that moment, you notice something unusual. It looks as if the someone just left the palace grounds by going over the hedge. Was that a servant, a thief, or an assassin? I'm going to... climb up. You look around for something to climb, but are unsure if the nearby trees can support your weight. Bollocks! You run over to a statue and try to pull yourself up on the pedestal, but it's too awkward to get your feet in place. By this time, whoever you saw has probably gone away. Elodie, you are terrible. Let's see, um... I'm gonna go to court again. <laughs> no one seemed to care that a lady in a tutu turned up to court. Okay, I guess we're... Oh, our current mood is depressed. Bollocks, I wanted it to be yielding. Uh, why? Why, princess? Why you no want to be a queen? Well, audience, this is where I'm going to leave our video. I'm sad that I didn't die, I'm sorry. I wanted to show you some of the amazingly silly deaths that you can apparently have in this game. Also, I've heard. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching. This has been Long Live the Queen. Cue the end Thank you very much for watching, my little teacups. I have been the over Englishman. This has been Long Live the Queen. If you'd like to see more episodes of this, then please leave a comment below. Otherwise, this is just going to be a one-off. Please never forget to like the video, to comment, to subscribe, to share this any way you feel like it. And please check out some of these beautiful people listed here. Thank you for watching. Have a cup of tea and farewell. And I finally actually get to use the save menu. Aha!